I don't give a fuck, Donald. It's you who's going to play the games, not me. No, Joe, we all agreed that it was you who was going to play this game. But at what moment, actually? I wasn't even there when you guys decided to fuck me once again. Guys, shut up. I'd like to listen to what's happening in the game's lore. Obama, the character is literally mute. I mean, the only thing he can do at the moment is breathe and drive a car, and you want to listen to what he has to say? What the fuck is this place again? Well, Joe, apparently it's a psychiatric asylum where they lock up the bad presidents who are not capable of properly taking care of their country. Hmm, but that does not make any sense since you are here. What the hell are you talking about? I'm the best president this country has had since Kennedy. Bro, is this guy asthmatic or what? I've never seen someone take so long to get out of their car. Since the video has just started and it's you who will be playing the game, I won't say anything, but you should really take a look in the mirror after waking up, Joe. Yeah, yeah, sure, let's get started. So what the fuck am I supposed to do here? I feel like I'm already lost. Are you guys still there? Well, Joe, we're not really sure what you're supposed to do here, honestly. Just walk and find something to go inside the Asylum, I don't know. So if I understood correctly, I'm a jerk of a journalist who received little information in a place that seems completely messed up, and I'm going into that place with no information? That's pretty much it, Joe. We have absolutely no idea what's going on in this place because we didn't want to be spoiled. So we'll literally discover what's happening here with you. Bro, you know how much I can freak out in these kinds of games, and now not only are you forcing me to play this game, but you can't even help me. Seriously, guys, I thought we were brothers. Joe, seriously, it's just a game. Plus, they have a garden and the sky looks beautiful. Nothing bad can happen here. Joe, there are platforms at the entrance. Take them and climb up. What the hell are you waiting for? Shut the fuck up, Donald. I remind you that it's me who plays the game and not you, so avoid being clever or else you will be the one who will play it. And we both know you're worse than me at these kinds of games. Joe, your madness is increasing day by day. Whether it's in FPS, MOBA, or horror games, I will still destroy you. I would even be capable of defeating you in a 1v1 only playing with my feet, you retard. Holy shit, this place looks exactly like my office in the White House. It's so cool. Joe, what the fuck are you talking about? Don't tell me that the photos you sent me last week were of my office. Uh, well, um, yeah, it was my office at the White House, yes. No fucking way it was my office. Are you trolling me or something? Are you trying to tell me that you managed to mess up my office just as if a homeless was passing by? Joe, answer me, you dirty little bitch. It's not my fault. Initially, I wanted to redecorate the office, but things went wrong, and I even ended up hurting my back during the renovations. What the fuck, Joe? How many people are there in the White House right now? Are you all alone or what? Well, um, there's me, my wife, two security guards, and the janitor, Arthur. Wait, Arthur is still working there? Yes, but he will soon retire, I think. Joe, seriously, where did all the others go? Well, um, since it's almost summer and there wasn't much going on, I decided to give them an eight-week vacation, except for the military team that handles essential matters. Is there nothing in what Joe just said that concerns you, Obama? Hey, why is there a bald guy in a prison outfit wandering around the hallways? Very well, then. What the fuck is that? Bro, my balls almost twist from themselves. The guy hanging from the ceiling thought he was Batman or what? Holy shit, this place has absolutely nothing to do with my White House. <laughs> they 
killed us. Joe, you fucking bitch, why are you filming? Help him. But what am I supposed to do? I literally have to watch and run like a cuck. I can't even help him. Joe is right, Donald. There are very few moments when the character is supposed to do anything other than survive, running, and filming. Typical from an American journalist, I guess. Joe, if you don't want to end up impaled like that guy, you should probably hurry. I don't judge people based on their appearance, but maybe we could have prevented this. Little fake. Yo, what the fuck was that monster? Was that the gory version of Winnie the Pooh? And who are you? Holy shit, bro, it's Mr. Beast. Joe, you're joking, right? Merciful God, you have sent me. Yo, these people are really fucked up in the head. A guy falls from a five meter height and he thinks he sees Jesus. The call to destroy America and make us look like fools internationally. Was that your call, Joe? No, that was yours, and you were very good on that one, to be honest. I don't know what happened here, seriously, but it's really a mess. It probably has something to do with the big guy we encountered earlier, or maybe something else. I don't know. Joe, please, I'm in the middle of eating my cheeseburger. Don't film this horror. Sorry about that. Trump, at what moment do you eat meat while watching a horror game? Are you a beast or something? Bro, I haven't eaten anything all day and I skipped breakfast. Dude, the documents I'm coming across are getting more and more macabre. Seriously, what kind of messed up secret program is this? Is it some sort of pharmaceutical company combined with a pedophile network or something? Are you saying that because you just saw a priest, or did you suddenly become intelligent? Both, I guess. But like, what am I supposed to do seriously? I don't know, Joe, just walk and find something. These motherfuckers look like they know what they're doing. Yo, what the fuck is it? Is he a human? I don't know, but we will find out. What kind of fucking abomination is this? They seek to create skin stealers or what? Oh, guys, I'm about to shit myself right now. Joe, don't even think about it. Are they brainwashing them or are these people just mentally fuck up? I'm telling you, next time it'll be Donald playing the game, I don't care. Go fuck yourself. No way I'm playing this game. Okay, perfect. We have a new credit card. Now what are we supposed to do with it? Obama, you must have a personalized card then because it looks more like an access card. And to answer your question, we probably need to open a wooden or steel door. I don't know. What the fuck? Oh my god, leave me alone, you skin steer. Yo, this guy must be high on cocaine. You know those moments when you're drinking water or something else and something scares you, causing you to choke? Well, that's just happened to me. Well, I guess we'll be able to get out of this place. You won't have to play the game any longer, Joe. Okay, it's probably this way. Let's go. That's not good. Was he running away from something or what? Because he didn't seem very aggressive. Joe, are you being sarcastic or are you as sick as these people? In your opinion, why is there blood on the walls? Yo, what is that son of a bitch doing right now? 
Oh, fuck. Someone is coming, Joe, so you better hide yourself. The nightmare version of Hulk is in front of you, and the only thing you know how to do is film it? That son of a bitch calls me Little Pig. I'm gonna kick his ass. Joe, don't be stupid. He's just going to rip your head off and play soccer with it. Fat ass plan on camping right in the middle of the doorway or what? Phew, finally. Well, I guess I'll have to wait like a coward until he leaves. Joe, what are you seriously doing? Obama, shut up. I'm sure he heard me open the door. He's gone now, Joe. You can go. Damn, that guy must be powerful to be able to break down a door like that. Joe, sorry to tell you, but you'll have to reactivate the power supply. How do you know that? God damn it, I don't want to go into the depths of hell. Don't worry, Joe. You'll make it. And in any case, if you die, Trump will take over. What the fuck? There is no way I'm going to play this game. I don't care. Well, if you don't do it, I'll report your character to Blizzard for buying gold from a website. Motherfucker. Fine, I will do it. Who's there? Oh, yeah, that makes sense now. And of course, if it's logical, there must be something to activate behind any door. This kind of thing is totally scripted. Man, this place is so fucking dark, holy shit. Good job, Joe. Only one more to go. I feel like someone is here. Now, Joe, it's just your dementia talking. Yeah, my dementia. Of course, you fucking bitch. Yeah, you should definitely stay away from that sick bastard, Joe. I feel like you will have to turn on the generator, too, if you want to leave this terrible place. Well, thank you, Doctor. Obvious. Hey, I'm just trying to help you, sick motherfucker. Come on, Joe, rush it. It will be over soon. What the fuck are you waiting for? Just leave this place so I don't have to play this game. You better shut up if you don't want me to commit suicide in game. What? But what is it? What else should I do seriously? Who is that? I... I'm sorry, but I can't help you on this one, Joe. I don't know if it's a bug or if we just forgot something. Wait a moment. Joe, I think you forgot about the door next to it. Take that one and maybe we'll find something. Man, you're such a piece of shit. You're only being nice to me because you know if I die, you'll have to play. I don't know what you're talking about, man. Bro, is this guy a cyclops or does he cosplay? What are you waiting for? Move! I don't know if it's my fear that speaks, but I've always had a big problem with black. What the fuck did you just say, Joe? Holy shit, I just realized, I'm sorry, Obama, I meant when I see no light. Bingo. Holy shit, I'm so proud of myself right now. I'm going to twist my nipples so hard after that one. Joe, seriously, what is wrong with you? No fucking way that guys just followed me. Hmm, Joe, are you sure about this? Oh. Fuck! Leave me alone, you crazy bitch. It's okay, Joe. You can outrun him easily since you're a journalist. Guys, where am I supposed to go? Go to the place where you came in, you idiot. You never get me, bitch. Good job, Joe. Now we can leave this shit place. I told you guys, I'm the best.
What the fuck is that noise? The big guys is here? Why is nothing on? Joe, you actually turn on the generator before leaving, right? Joe, I'm talking to you. Well, hum, for my defense, I have to say that I was actually focused on saving my life. Guys, I'm a bit sleepy. Let's finish that another day. Very well, then. I need to do some inventory before sleeping. I'm leaving you guys take care. All right, see you guys, and don't forget to subscribe. So guys, what have you been up to since the last time? Not much, Joe, apart from the fact that my Blizzard account got banned because of a certain person who snitched on me. Oh crap. Well, I'm really sorry, Donald. What's the reason for the ban and for how long? Well, I bought gold from a site illegally, which was 100% safe, and the ban takes me three months, all thanks to you, Obama. Trump, believe me or not, I assure you that I haven't snitched on anything at all. In fact, I have far more things to reproach myself for in this game than you do. So if I were to report you, I would probably get something worse in return. I would like to believe you, but it's impossible. Besides you and Joe, and in this case, I know very well that it can't be him. Only you were aware of absolutely everything. Hmm. I think I have a fairly logical explanation for that. To be completely honest, it's probably my fault. Last week, I started a stream, and luckily, I had quite a few viewers. The problem is that I was on our Discord conversation at that time, so people were likely able to see our conversation and our secrets. You did what? Joe, please tell me that you were not on the Joke NSFW channel. Joe, I promise you that I won't be mad at you, so please answer me. I didn't show the channel, only the general one. Okay, then. Let's focus on the game for now, and we can think about a way to recover Donald's account later. I've always been focused on the game, but okay. So we just got injected with something by the crazy priest next to us, and apparently there's some kind of entity straight out of the back rooms juggling with security guards. Don't tell me I'm a cell again. It seems more like a crazy room, Joe, and what do you mean by again? Don't worry, nothing. It's only my madness speaking. These people must be extremely religious, considering the number of crosses on the walls, or perhaps they have something very serious to feel guilty about. How can I escape from this place? Try opening the door. Maybe it's not locked. Joe, open the door. What are you waiting for? Sorry, guys. I was eating something. I'm here now. All right, let's leave this place. Holy shit, that scared me. It may not only be bad people here. It seems like this guy has done the job for us. Are you sure about that, Obama? Okay, let's pretend that I didn't say anything at all. Trump, would you like to play so I can chill a bit? No, Joe, you haven't died accidentally yet, so it's up to you to continue. I won't play this game, Joe, believe me. Maybe Father Martin is mad. Maybe. He looks nervous. I would like to kill him. A massive guy, a priest, and now we have the brothers of Shrek. We find everything in this asylum. Not here. We give him a running start. There's an idea. And when we kill him, we kill him slow. Such patience. I want his tongue and liver. They are yours. Hmm, I'd better stay away from those people, I think. Probably the best idea you've ever had in your life, Joe. You look like you've seen okay, at this stage, there are only two options for me. Option one, these people have been deceived by the doctors of this institution and have had very bad experiences. Option two, they have all played too much League of Legends. My goodness, where is all that noise coming from? It's probably nothing, Joe. Don't worry. Holy shit. What the hell is that man doing? Seriously, what is this game? I hope we don't get demonetized here. 
Uh, okay, so basically that man is desecrating the corpse and I'm the one who has a problem. This is truly ridiculous. Let it go, Joe. Listening to or engaging with these kinds of people is a waste of time. Let them stay in their own realm. At least now we know where all the delusional bitch end up. The longer I stay here, the more I feel like vomiting. Seriously, guys, this game is making me sick to my stomach. Am I dreaming, or is this guy banging his head against the wall as if it were a keyboard? Oh, for fuck's sake, just leave me alone, please. Well, I guess we can follow the trail of blood left by the priest, then. Am I getting mustard gas in the face or something else? It's the first time I've been so happy to see a ladder. Why? Are you too fat for walking on that? What the hell are you talking about? It's just my bone structure. You must have dinosaur bones, then. A small cheeseburger wouldn't hurt him. So guys, are you planning to play the new Diablo or not? Personally, I think it's... I might be becoming a boomer, but the ending seems really disappointing compared to Diablo 3. What the hell is that man talking about? I'm not interested in Diablo, but considering what Blizzard has done to Overwatch, it doesn't surprise me. I don't know what's happening next to me, but I really don't feel like playing anymore. Bro preparing the best kebab of his life or what? No problem, especially since the character hasn't said a word for a while. I will be careful from now on. Take your time, Joe. If you die, I'll be the one forced to play. Yeah, what the fuck is he doing here? I can't believe that guy was actually waiting here for some reason. At least the other guy and his kebab are still watching us. Get cucked, motherfucker. Good job, Joe. Now rush the room and lock the door. What the fuck? The path seemed much shorter earlier. All of this for a stupid red button? I've never felt more cheated in my life. Joe, I know what you're thinking. Don't even dare to try dying now, motherfucker. I just want to breathe. Oh my god, leave me alone. Hey, what's with this twisted move? Did I go through all of that just to get tear gassed in the face? Joe, seriously, it's just a decontamination center. Calm down, everything is fine. Oh no, the Shrek brothers are back. Are these people slow to catch on or are they just doing it on purpose? Oh, I have no idea, Donald. I just want to go home. I'm tired of this place. Where did they go? Forget about Joe. Focus on the arrow and everything will be fine. Very fucking well then. Was he being chased by a guard or something? The guy took the time to leave blood on the walls but didn't give us the access cards? What the fuck was that? But this guy is completely fuck up or what? Also what to contain, COVID? Just move and stop talking, Joe, seriously. Well, that was easy, but I fear for what is coming next. Dude, I hear things at my place. I think someone broke into my house. Obama, stop talking nonsense. It's probably just a cat or else. Wait, what the fuck? Take it easy with the card, Joe. 
I hope they will be healed in the end. Holy shit, I don't care, I jump. Are they just pretending to want to eat you or are they completely stupid? I admit the Shrek brothers are acting in a strange way, but maybe something happened to them. If you're talking about experiences, pedophiles, Winnie the Pooh, as well as the future programs of psychological and physical torture that they conduct in this asylum, then yes, strange things are happening here. And we've only just started playing the game, so just imagine all the crazy things that might happen here. Oh, I have a bad feeling about this place, guys. Stop being a bitch and move forward, Joe. Oh, I almost forgot to ask, Joe, the famous decoration you made at the White House, it wasn't a troll, right? Did you really create all that mess? I've restored everything to its original state, don't worry about that. I can't believe this guy followed me all the way here. I have to get out of this place. Dude, I'm such a rat. Whenever I'm scared, I hide in tunnels. I hate everything about this game. No way I'm playing next time. Joe, holy shit, man. Calm down. It's just a game. Fuck you, Obama. Man, this whole place going down. What the hell? Well, that was quite a fall. Oh no, guys, I'm gonna throw up. Joe, don't even think about it. Yeah, no, now that's enough. Guys, I didn't sign up for this. From now on, Donald will play the game, and if you don't agree, you can fuck off. Joe, come on, don't be like that. Joe, are you still there? He muted himself on Discord and turned off his microphone. Next time you will play, and if you don't feel capable, I'll do it. Well, at least we made progress thanks to Joe. Well, subscribe and remember to like the video for Joe. Okay, Joe, I agree to play this game and maybe the next one if it goes well. But don't count on me to play Minecraft with you for at least two months. What the? But I didn't ask you anything, man, so why are you dooming me? Seriously, Joe, you didn't ask for anything? In case you've forgotten, let me remind you that you acted like a little bitch last time, even though you hadn't even played for an hour. You even rage quit at the end, you degenerate motherfucker. Joe, I can send you to prison with all the files I have on you, and Donald, it seems like you want to recover your World of Warcraft account, right? So stop behaving like 14-year-old children. All right, very well then. <gasps> Donald, what are you doing? Wasn't there someone behind the door a few seconds ago? Joe, I have absolutely no idea what I'm doing right now. I'm just playing, and if I see someone, I'll kick their ass. Donald, even though I respect your determination, remember that your character cannot fight. Seriously, what is this place? I don't even dare to imagine what's behind those curtains. I'm just afraid that someone will come out from one of those curtains to kill us. Well, there's our way out, I suppose. Seriously, can't the character move a bit faster? Even my walking speed is better. Are you a rat or what? Son of a bitch, this lunatic is going to get me into trouble with all that screaming. Oh my god, no, Donald, you need to run now. That's what I'm trying to do, Joe, but first I have to push this cube to open the door and then run. I don't think you needed to block the door, Donald. Obama, whether it's in my career or in a game, I prefer to cover my back. How do you think I manage to keep all my stuff every time, seriously? Oh no, holy shit, Donald. These people will never leave you alone. Don't stop, keep going. I'm trying, Joe, I'm trying. Oh my God, when will all of this finally come to an end? Show me that all those cardio sessions that I paid for you have served a purpose, Donald. Obama, it's just a video game, not real life, but I'll still do it for you, motherfucker. You 
Damn, that was a nice jump. Oh, you would like to jump like, don't you? Okay, but where exactly am I supposed to go through now? Donald, are you completely stupid or what? You just need to continue straight ahead, seriously. Screw you, Obama. Donald, did you steal money from those sick people or something? Joe, shut the fuck up. It's not the time for that. You're not one of them, are you? Quick, get in the dumb waiter if you want to. Oh, finally, someone who can help me. Get cucked, motherfucker. What the fuck? It seems like you're the one who got cuckolded, Donald. Motherfucker, I have your head for that. What the fuck did you just say, Donald? Oh, hum, I was talking about the crazy doctor in front of me. Let's take a break, huh, buddy? The old two martini lunch? Have a little confab. Does this lunatic think he's working in a five star restaurant reception or something? A little cardio wouldn't kill you? Okay, here we go, arms and legs inside the car at all. Literally the sanest doctor in Ohio. This doctor doesn't look very bad. I think he had to adapt to the patient he met in this asylum. Joe, the first image that came to my mind when I saw his face was a mix between a Nazi and a damn psychopath. No, and you dare to tell me he doesn't look here. that mean? You, you want to... And you, you're just a big obese jerk who judges others too much based on their appearance. Look, he's even engaging in conversation with us. No? What the fuck are you talking about? Donald, calm down. Don't engage in this kind of argument with him. It won't lead to anything. Don't turn the camera to the right, Donald. Why not? Well, if you don't want to get demonetized, you should just listen to me and do as I say. Phew, I'm not sure what you meant, Obama, but thank you anyway. Kill me. Yes, Joe, this doctor oh, seems like a very kind person, anyway. right? Truth be told, I was just tired. Bro, this guy is as calm as a watch salesman. Thanks so much for coming by. We'll begin your consultation in a moment. It'll just need a second to watch. Okay, no way am I going to make it out of this alive. Please, someone help me, please. No movies. Don't worry, Donald. I don't think it's going to end this way. Everything will be fine. However, I'm not sure what he's going to do to you. I'm not a doctor, but I don't think it's always necessary to wash your hands when you're living in this hell. You know, I'm a bit worried how much time you've been spending with Father Martin. I know, I hope you haven't been letting him confuse you with all his holier-than-thou Bible thumping. Uh, no offense to the man, but I sometimes worry he might just be a little bit you son of a bitch, don't even touch me. I'm telling you right away. It's understandable. Did this guy study medicine in Ohio or what? God died with the gold standard. We're on to a more concrete thing now. You have to rob Paul to pay Peter. There's no other way. Murder in it is the simplest one, but what happens when all money's gone? Hey, what are you planning to do with my fingers? Well, money becomes a matter of faith. And that's what I'm here for. What the fuck is he doing? Let me go, you fucking bitch! Oh my god. You paying attention? What the hell did that guy just bitch slap me after cutting my finger? It's probably the most disgusting thing I've ever seen in my entire life. Fucking shitty life. This thing is gonna sell its Okay, let me summarize what just happened to me. First, I got baited. Then this guy cut off two of my fingers, bitch slapped me, and now he wants to sell the two little fingers he just cut off? Are you shocked or are you being serious? Ew, what the fuck is that?
You see, guys, this is the kind of game where you just want one thing, to have a weapon and kill the guy who's annoying you. You should try Alien Isolation, then. No, Joe, we've been playing too many horror games lately. Next time, let's do something chill. Maybe we could try going out next time, don't you think? I won't trust anyone in this damn asylum anymore after what just happened to me. Chilled with Vernicke's nightmares. He worked so well. They couldn't control it. And you can't control it. Nobody's. Nobody. No, but seriously, Nobody. why does he seem normal for 10 seconds and then start screaming like crazy? I'm so now. sick of those people. It's Drag Bait Asylum. Drag oh. 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 I see what's happening. You're bored. You want a little attention. Perfectly understandable. I'm here for you. I'll give you very special attention. Joe, you're quite the comedian. Remind me never to trust you with my secrets. Well, if I want them to be safe. Why do you say that? I did not say anything. Joe, you literally told us that this guy seemed really nice when he's actually a huge psychopath. What's your problem, seriously? Let's teach you the seven habits of highly eviscerated people. Hold up there, buddy. Get locked, motherfucker. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, you dirty bitch. Speed that motherfucker, Donald. You can do it. How is this guy able to climb up quickly despite there being a lot of blood? Isn't he supposed to slip? I don't know, dude. Just watch the game and eat your little sandwich. All right. Wait a second. How do you know that I'm eating a sandwich? You're asking too much question for a president, Joe. Man, this corridor is the ninth gate of hell, or what is going on? You fat piece of shit, how slow are you to throw that stuff? Obama, I swear, if you assume my fitness level one more time, I will send the dark meme you posted on Discord to Michelle. I don't know what you're talking about, dude. Here, I'm deleting them. Obama, you fucking bitch. If I was not playing this one, I would fuck you up so bad for that. Guys, calm down. What is wrong with you? Holy shit, I'm so good at this game. Literally speed running this shit right now. Wait, don't tell me I just went in circles. I don't think so, Donald. This is the longest hallway you've taken so far, so you're on the right track. Nice. Holy shit! Donald, what the hell are you doing? Bro, I need some proof for this one. Holy shit, he will finally make it. What the hell? What do you mean by finally make it? Holy shit, here we go, motherfucker. I'm not giving up. Oh, oh, that's not good. Stand back, you crazy bitch. Aim for his balls. Overpower this motherfucker. What the fuck? Good job, Donald. Nice one, man. Thanks, I guess. All right, Joe, I'll leave you in charge of the game since you've regained your balls. But don't disappoint us this time. Donald, trust me. If ever I encounter a problem, I'll just have to grab the ice cream next to me to boost my morale. Carve you up like the others. Meet me outside. We're close now. All right, well, we just have to do what our priest friend just said, and everything will be fine. By the way, Joe, you're quite a character. Is one ice cream enough to boost your morale in any possible situation? Obama, I'm telling you, as long as I have my ice cream, nothing is impossible for me. Last time, I didn't have any. Mmm, I feel like having a little ice cream now. Come on, Joe, finish the game quickly so I can go get one. 
I don't know about you guys, but the only thing that really scares me in this game is the aggressively popping music every time that something happens. For your information, Joe, each piece of music creates a different atmosphere, and horror games films have understood this well. Moreover, Outlast is one of the first games to have started mastering this technique in the world of video games. Oh well, it works for me, I admit. Whether it's before or after, those disgusting people could have made an effort regarding the internal decoration of their workplace. Joe, I appreciate the fact that you are passionate about decoration, but you should probably spend more time playing Minecraft and practicing to create better builds before engaging in real-life interior decoration, especially considering what you almost did at the White House. Thank, I guess. Um, what did I do at the White House? Joe, do you see what's happening on the screen? Well, there's your answer. All of it. Murkoff took so much from us. Used us. I don't know why, but this guy reminds me of Gordon Ramsay after having the worst kitchen team in the world. Ha 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 ha, good one, Joe. So let it burn. Joe, stop listening to this guy and leave. It's his problem if he wants to die now. Get up. Joe, seriously, what are you doing? Obama, let me enjoy the game for fuck's sake. Here we go. Well, I hope I don't run into that big guy who calls me a little pig every time. Joe, you know very well that you're going to encounter him at some point. I don't know why, but that lunatic holds a grudge against you. Ah, for fuck's sake, my wife ate the last ice cream. I had to order some Ben and Jerry's. Donald, you know that stuff will give you diabetes, right? It's the fifth pint you've eaten this week. Obama, my body is capable of handling much more than that. Damn, until now nothing has scared me. Is it the power of ice or is the level just calm enough? Probably both, but mostly because the level is chill, I guess. Whether calm or not, one thing is certain. We will be forced to use the camera more and more now. Joe, for fuck's sake, cut off your Discord notification. I will do it later, sorry. Joe, did you launch the right game? Because I don't really feel like we're playing Outlast here. It's much calmer than the last times. Bro, the ton of documents we're getting since we started playing this game is really messy. It's supposed to help us understand the game, I guess. Hey guys, would you like to do Airsoft with me next time? No fucking way I'm playing Airsoft with you again, Obama. If it means you'll be camping in the same spot with your sniper like a coward. What are you talking about? I wasn't camping, I was holding a position. And did you expect to go unnoticed with your bright pink bulletproof vest in a goddamn forest? What the fuck is Airsoft? Joe, seriously, you are joking, right? Here we go again. Oh, come on, guys. Of course I'm joking. Well, uh, I feel like it's going to get really challenging from now on, though. I wonder if there is still a lot left to do in this game. At least halfway there, Joe. After all, we've already seen quite a bit so far, so I don't see how it could get any worse. Wow, what a jinx, Donald. Look like you bring bad luck upon us. What the fuck are you talking about? I am the trinity of this group. It must be a trinity manufactured in China, then. Guys, be quiet. I'm being chased by this creature. Fortunately, this thing is as stupid as its appearance already suggests. Wait, hold on. Are you referring to me or the monster? To you, Joe, I mean... Oh, the monster that has been chasing you from the beginning, of course. Ah, for fuck's sake. Come on, come on, move faster. I think you should start running, Joe. He won't hear you. If I do that, he will probably kill me. Besides, this guy moves as slowly as I do in real life, so do you really think he will be gone already? Joe, seriously, even while eating an ice cream, you remain the same bitch. This guy likes to take his time. Well, guys, besides the fact that we know he's capable of ripping our heads off, do we know who this guy is? Apparently his name is Chris Walker or something like that. He's a patient who underwent experiments like everyone else here. 
I can always look it up in the Outlast wiki, I guess. The thing I find really interesting, albeit quite bizarre, is that ever since we started playing the game, we've been chased by a big fat guy, a doctor, the Shrek brothers, and yet we still haven't really figured out what actually happened. Joe, we'll play the DLC later, so we'll probably get a little idea of how it actually started. Was that guy camping here all along, or did I just not see him? That's really funny. He's waiting over there as if he just got cucked. Ha 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 ha! Donald, what the fuck was that laugh? I don't know. Ask Eleven Labs. Always sticking to your little habits, huh, Joe? What the fuck are you talking about? Just a reminder, you were the one who was scared. You used blocks to lock the door the last time you played. I see that your memory isn't playing tricks on you anymore, Joe. I told you, Donald, when I have an ice cream next to me. Oh, fuck, it just melted. It'll be okay, Joe. Even without ice cream, you can do it. Guys, there was still a bit of ice cream left. My wife had hidden it behind the lettuce. That stupid bitch. What flavor is your ice cream, Donald? My favorite cookie dough. If only I had a weapon on me to kill the monster that's constantly chasing me. Don't worry, Joe. The game's DLC is even worse than this. You'll have to run even more and nothing else. It's really frustrating. I hate games where you're forced to do only one thing without any other possible alternatives. Joe, you fucking clown. Even when several alternatives are offered to you at the White House, you almost always choose the same one, but in a worse way. So what are you talking about? One more to go, and fuck you, Donald. Well, I guess we can move on to the next level, then. I bet you $20 that this big pig will still be there when I try to leave. Let's go, I won. Come on, send me your money now. Joe, that's not how a bet works. The others have to accept the bet, otherwise nothing happens. Wait, what? But Donald told me it worked differently when he made a bet with me. I don't know what you're talking about, Joe. You definitely know what I'm talking about, Donald. You started a bet and took $200 from me even though I hadn't even agreed to it. Nah, Joe. I think you forgot to take your pills and your dementia is playing tricks on you. Seriously, how much longer does he plan on staying here? I think he has already left, Joe. You can start going out, and if you see him, just run to distance yourself. He may be strong, but he's still quite slow. Joe, stop playing like a little bitch and run to the exit. He's not going to kill you in real life either. But how would you know? I almost had a heart attack last time I played that game and fell asleep, remember? Joe, that's not my problem. You wanted to finish the game, so now you have to figure it out and run, for heaven's sake. I have the impression that there's an issue with this ambient noise, though. Have you noticed how the music is still present even when the character is more than 20 meters away from us? It's crazy, isn't it? I don't know what's more crazy, Joe's way of playing or what you just told me, but I can imagine, yes. Joe, seriously, you took one hour to do that. You're such a bitch. Hey, take it easy. It's hard to find a way in this asylum. Joe, with all the arrows on the walls and the number of times we've told you to check the room at the very end, I think there comes a point where we can't help you any further. Wasn't it supposed to be the place where everything was on fire with Gordon Ramsay? I think so too, but I believe he must have died since then. <gasps> you were supposed to be dead, what the hell? What's his problem? Is this guy completely bitching or something? I don't know, but I almost shit myself. Holy shit, that is disgusting. I wonder if there's anything to eat in this place. Donald, do you see someone on a table in the worst possible condition and you're wondering what you can eat next to them? Are you a demon or something? Oh wow, guys, I managed to find the exit. Well done, Joe. You can start heading out now, hoping that it's really the end. Although I can already imagine the response. I don't know why, but something is making me scared. Joe, you're scared more than half the time, so it's probably not a big deal. Just go ahead and come out.
I should probably join that source of light in front of me. Come on, come on, tell me it's open. Holy shit. What the fuck was that? Are we playing Ghostbuster or something? Was that the thing he calls Wool Rider or something like that? Psychopathic patients, completely insane doctors, and now I'm being chased by a demon? It is indeed quite strange. Obama, did you know about this? Obama, are you still alive? Sorry I was eating my grilled cheese sandwich, and no, I didn't know about that honestly. I'm starting to realize how important batteries are in this game. Well, I think we'll be able to escape from this cursed garden from now on. Holy shit, I fear the worst. Holy motherfucking shit. Oh my god, I saw him. It looks like our friend is on the verge of having a heart attack. It would only be missing if he stepped on a Lego to end his suffering. Joe, please turn off your night vision seriously. Go fuck yourself, man. I can't see shit without that stuff. Holy shit, please God help us. Do ghosts exist in the Outlast universe or something? Seriously, I thought we were just journalists. Where are the priests when we need them, seriously? You are the only one who should know the answer, Joe. Oh my God, I would kill someone for a delicious chocolate ice cream right now. Too bad for you, Joe. Personally, I just finished mine. You definitely took your time to suck it, you fucking bastard. Hey guys, have you ever heard of that strange game with talking weapons? Personally, I find it really boring, and the game style makes me feel completely drugged. I don't mind if you're talking about the game I think you are, but I actually find it quite amusing, honestly. What the fuck are you guys talking about? Not much, Joe. You'll get your answer if a certain person decides to force us to play the game. Hmm. Well, in that case, um... Is the game almost finished where there's still a lot of gameplay left? Because I'll have to leave soon. Joe, the question is, why do you have to leave now? I honestly don't know anymore, but I do know that I have to leave soon. No, Joe, that's just your dream telling you that. In reality, you'll stay seated in your chair and play until the game is finished, or else I'll come and kick your ass. Oh, well, I just saw that my appointment has been canceled. That's really strange. I can't believe I've been wandering around for several moments just to find an opening. Seriously, sometimes I disgust myself. In your defense, Joe, none of us managed to see what was happening, and considering how boring that gameplay section was, I think we'll cut it out in editing. Perhaps it's not a bad idea, I guess. Oh wow, something different from what I'm used to seeing, the exit. Fuck! For fuck's sake, how'd that man actually end up here? Bro, I've never wanted to kill someone so badly. I swear I'm going to go on a shooting rampage against this ugly motherfucker. Get baited, you fat bitch. You had a fat to go into that hole, huh? Should have done some cardio instead of staying at home, you fucking victim. Yo, Joe, calm down. It's over now. Bro, that fat guy was chasing us like we were gold digger. Talking about gold diggers, did you stop playing VR chat and hiring escorts who were probably guys, or are you still being a complete coomer over this? I stopped. Um, wait, hold on. I don't know what you're talking about, man. Well, it seems our friend has stopped being a Mac. So, Joe, how does it feel to be fucking normal? I don't know, Obama. What about you? How does it feel to be a backseater? Joe, don't try to act like a Giga Chad just because you managed to play without getting scared once. Next time, it'll be my turn to play. Crazy motherfucker. So, um, are we going to finish this game or not? Yes, but in multiple parts, since After Effects decided to annoy us by crashing every three minutes, despite the fact that we have Giga Chad PC. Ah, we finally find our pedophile. Come on, say hello to your brother, Joe. But not yet. 
What the hell are you talking about? I'm not a pedophile. I mean, it's not my brother. Yeah, of course, Joe, and I'm not black. All right, folks, this is the end of this video. Remember to like and subscribe to our channel, and most importantly, share and have fun. Joe, I'm going to kick your ass. Come here, you piece of shit. Hey, guys, due to some technical issues, we had to skip several steps of the gameplay. Enjoy watching. Phew, retrieving that key wasn't a walk in the park. I've never seen so many naked men in my life. Which naked man are you talking about, Joe? I've been watching your gameplay since Donald disappeared, and there were only clothed people chasing you with a knife. Wait, what? But that's impossible. There were no clothes on my screen. They were definitely naked. What are you talking about? Okay, okay, let's pretend there were indeed naked people. End of the story. Man, I'm sick of this, dude. Hey guys, I've retrieved the ice cream I ordered earlier. By the way, why are you talking about naked men? Have you become gay or what? Well, we were talking about... You know what? Never mind. Holy shit, what is he doing down there? I'm gonna spit on his head, hold on. Joe, you crazy motherfucker. He hasn't done anything to you yet. Do you plan on decorating every smooth skull you come across or what? What's your problem? <laughs> I can't imagine the pain that poor man must be feeling jumping on platforms with two missing fingers. It was a bit too easy. Yo, what the fuck was that? Is that the demon from before? Holy shit, no, I don't want to die. Joe, put yourself together, you crazy bitch. Well, we managed to make it back to the top, and now I guess we have to head towards that suspicious door we saw earlier. I can still take control of the game if you want. You can't trust anything in this place. I wonder if people have already died of a heart attack while playing this game. What the hell, did we reach the mattress clearance sale or something? Joe, seriously, do you still have an ice cream next to you or not? Well, I finished the last ice cream last night, so I'm trying not to think about it too much. But I think I'm becoming mentally strong. Yo, this place is as messed up as Iraq after your stomp Obama. I could say the same about you after you go to McDonald's. Bitch, I haven't been to McDonald's since last night. I mean, last month, so what are you talking about? Yeah, that's what I thought. Addicted to the core and incapable of controlling your choices. Impossible. How did they manage to find me? Joe, you filthy piece of shit. You literally just opened the door after they had just closed it. Get baited, motherfucker. Oh my god, Joe, you're really lucky. I didn't know it was possible to do that. I told you, Obama, I'm the best. You're mostly the most asleep and useless president I've ever seen in my entire fucking life, yes. Why is that bald son of a bitch here? And what is he saying, doing some voodoo incantation or something? What the hell are you talking about? Speaking English is voodoo for you? Wait, does that mean I can do magic just by speaking English? That's probably why every person falls asleep in front of me. I'm a magician. Joe, seriously, what is wrong with you? Shut the fuck up. Look at me. I'll prove to you that I'm better than you. <laughs> oh, fuck no. It's okay, Joe. Use your magician skills and fly in the air. No fucking way. The camera with all my secret file. God damn it, don't tell me I'm gonna have to go down in the dark to get her back. Obama, would you like to play the game instead of me? Go fuck yourself, Joe. You're not gonna behave like a child to ask someone else to make up for your shit. Is that how you work in the White House? Very well, then. Joe, you fucking magician. How did you get here seriously? Ooh, guys, I think I crushed my balls. What, but how is it possible? Joe Biden, President. More like Joe Biden, the balls crusher. Guys, this is not cool. I literally just crushed my balls right now. 
Looks like you managed to find your stuff, Joe. Holy shit, I need to get out of here. Did they all just spawn there, or were they peacefully waiting nearby? Oh god, no. My camera is in a bad state. I hope we'll be able to retrieve everything we just filmed. I want to recover everything that happened on Roblox. Wait, what am I saying? The game files. Oh my, I'm going crazy. Did we just witness Biden's first step towards escaping his dementia? If that is indeed the case, there may still be hope for this country. Damn, that was stressful. Ah! Holy shit, Joe, I really thought you were going to fall or that the platform was going to collapse once again. Same here, honestly, I would have stopped playing and let Obama take his turn. Seriously, once is funny, but too often it's annoying. We still have to see the bright side of things. For example, you went from being a bitch to a guy who can play a horror game for over an hour. Sure, you need to eat ice cream at the same time, but there's definitely an improvement. You are trolling me, right? Most of the time, you're mean to me, even when I do good things. And now you realize that I've been doing some good stuff? Seriously, guys, is that real or is it the person writing the script who decides to make me intelligent? Joe, what the fuck are you talking about? Yeah, Joe, I was starting to regain hope and now you're talking about someone with a script. <clears throat> Seriously, dude, is everything okay with you? Are you guys completely stupid or what? Since we've been making videos together for a while, haven't you noticed anything? You're not going to tell me that our videos edit themselves, right? Joe, what do you mean exactly? How do you know you're not impatient? What I mean is that I have the impression that I'm the only one realizing that we're not the real owners of this YouTube channel. We film and we talk, but I feel like we're being used over and over again. Seriously, are you not going to tell me that you haven't noticed anything? Joe, have you watched The Matrix recently or something else? Bro think he's Neo now. Obama, you literally talked about someone scripting the previous episode and even mentioned an episode about the back rooms. Joe, I don't know if you're trolling me or if your power is stronger than ever, but you're starting to scare me. And I honestly have no recollection of that. You're not going to kill us, right? What? Joe, seriously, shut up and focus on the game. There's still the music of the big weird monster. Avoid it and get your character out of here. I hope he didn't see me. I don't want to die after putting in so much effort, seriously. I'll leave you for a minute, guys. I'm gonna grab a little ice cream. It's way too hot. Despite the fact that you just gave me proof that you are no longer capable of leading this country, I have to admit that this bait was powerful, Joe. Hugh, there's nothing worse than manipulating dead bodies. I was about to say something, but I'm restraining myself now. Yo, what the fuck is he doing here? Mexican or everywhere or what? Bro, that's just a patient. I wonder where is that beautiful music coming from? Honestly, Joe, I really don't want to know. Oh, we found our artist. You see, Donald, he's just a... A monster? A demon? The Queen of England? Is that what you meant to say, Joe? Bro, I almost shit my pants. Uh, exit How long has it been since Obama left the call? Oh, fuck. Sorry, guys. I was here all along. It's just that I forgot to unmute myself. Guys, I'm gonna go now. I need to sleep. Plus, this movie is bad, so there's nothing to lose. Joe, seriously, I just unmute myself. Obama, come on, it's fine. Beside, we can play a bit of Sea of Thieves for one hour if you want. All right, well, like always, my friends, I'm just gonna ask you to like the video, subscribe, and most importantly, don't hesitate to share. It really motivates us to keep going. Goodbye, and see you next time. Joe, there's something I'm having trouble understanding. Last time you talked about someone writing a script right after you pretended to be a magician. 
Are you a lunatic or is there drugs in your ice cream? I don't take any of this and it's pointless for me to continue discussing all of this with you as I feel like I'm the only person seeing what's happening here. So say whatever you want, it won't change anything. You realize how screwed we are, don't you, Obama? Seriously, do you realize that this guy is leading our poor country right now thanks to you? What the hell are you talking about? I didn't do anything. Obama, you should have fired this guy the day you realized he was way too special to handle anything, and in the end, you let him corrupt the White House. It's all about you, Obama. Donald, seriously, no matter what I would have done, I mean, firing him would have avoided some problems, but if he is currently in power, it's mainly because of you, you know? Acting poorly as a president and making decisions that resemble those of a child just starting kindergarten when you're angry or frustrated doesn't necessarily make people want to vote for you again and have you as their president. Obviously, you have made some good change, but still, next time, maybe you could put in a bit more effort. For fuck's sake, who's chasing me in a cinema? Seriously. Most likely the Pokemon ghost that you've chased in the past, Joe. Fucking disgusting. Is it so hard for these people to wear pants once in a while? Fortunately, this one is completely blind, or perhaps he just wanted to watch a movie. Maybe you should go say hello to him, Joe. I'm a nice person, but not to the extent of getting violently killed, Obama. Joe, you fucking bastard, did you get lost again? No, the exit is right in front of us. Well, not literally, but I just have to unlock the door that's right next to us. You see everything good? Yeah, yeah, it was just luck, Joe, nothing more. Seriously, dude, why do you have to be such a little bitch every time? If I'm a bitch, I don't know what word to use to define you, Joe. In fact, I think I should ask Elon Musk to send me to a planet to learn a new universal language because we would need to create an entirely unique word just for you. Yeah, well, we should create a new food that regenerates continuously just for you, you fat bastard. Speaking of food, here's a kitchen room, Donald. You will be able to do a mukbang for the Our YouTube channel. Go fuck yourself. Guys, what is a mukbang? Do you know Nikocado Avocado? The guy who looks like Jimmy Neutron? If no, check his channel. But where is this noise coming from? Is someone praying to a god outside my door or what? Oh my god, it's the Iraqis. When I think about it, I find the concept of locking up in the asylum psychopaths, sociopaths, pedophiles, and any other type of problematic individuals in our society to be really cool. Same goes for people who constantly cover themselves up, even when they know deep down that they have messed up to the extent that they can no longer make a difference between something good and wrong. Right, Joe? Oh, shit, I forgot you're one of those people. Why are they praying exactly? Do they think they will be forgiven for all the harm they have done or something? This isn't a kebab shop here. Go ahead and jump, Joe. What are you waiting for? Go fuck yourself. Come on, Joe, I'm joking. Don't you know how to take a joke anymore? Bro, the character is so strong that he slides to the other window without slipping, even while it's raining. Why can't you do all that in real life, Joe? Seriously. Bro, are you expecting me to be Batman or something? I already struggle to run properly, just like Donald. The fuck are you talking about? What I'm saying is that you are incapable of running properly. Joe, you little skinny guy, I am literally the strongest president to ever exist. So what are you talking about? Strongest, more like delusional. What on earth is happening here? Why are the Shrek brothers here? And why is a person being crucified in the center of the room? We will join the wall rider. This young madman thinks he's a Christian piñata. Yo, this guy is even crazier than Joe. Joe, you should try to help him. What are you waiting for? Reason with him. Obama, you are even more delusional than I am. I remind you that I can do nothing except run, hide, and film everything that happens in this place. 
Joe, the question is not about what you can do in the game, but what you are capable of doing to change certain situations within the game. Man, you are not making any sense. I think you should join the priest in his madness. What the fuck, Obama? Are you assuming that he should kill himself or what? Joe, stop being awoke and shut your mouth. All right. Joe, what is he doing? That guy was really serious. He immolated himself without questioning. What a giga chad. Yo, that guy is taking his time. Does getting burned alive really take that long? I don't know, Obama. You should ask your drone operator. Mmm, bro, this shit makes me want to have a barbecue. You see a guy getting immolated with followers praying to him like he's Jesus, and it makes you want to have a barbecue. Are you a cannibal or something? All right, let's take a short break and eat something. The fuck is wrong with you? Hey guys, did you know that there are more levels in Escape the Backrooms? Isn't it awesome? Man, just when I wanted to discuss something cool, this big fat guy shows up. Let's focus on the game, Joe. We can discuss later. If you die now, we'll have to start everything over again. Guys, I'll play the final match next time. Is that okay with all of you? Obama, given the current situation, I doubt it could get any worse, so go ahead if you want to. What do you mean by current situation, Donald? Yo, this fat fuck is still behind us. Do we have some kind of dark past with him or what? Holy shit, I can't even get through there. It's not possible. Joe, you're the luckiest man I've ever seen in my life. Isn't that guy supposed to be a one-shot kill on the first shot? It's not luck, it's skill, Donald. Oh fuck, he found me. Rush the elevator, Joe. It's not complicated. Come on, man, you can do it. Fuck! He's right behind me. Joe, you should play in a casino seriously. I've never seen such ridiculously high luck in my life. As long as it's not your casino, I'm in. And what is that supposed to mean? Well, it must be said that your casino is a failure, Donald. Go fuck yourself, Barack. My casino was a success. Not my fault if you guys are delusional. Oh my god, I finally made it, guys. I hope the elevator doesn't explode for some paranormal reason. Obama, stop it. You're gonna bring us bad luck. Hey, what's happening? Barack, what have you done? Do you guys expect me to use voodoo magic because I'm black or what? I haven't done anything, so leave me alone. I'm telling you, Joe, it's a bad idea to let Obama play this one. He's going to insult us once again if the end is bad. I don't see why you're saying that, but in any case, I was supposed to play the last game and you didn't even let me play once since the beginning, so can I at least have the ending, right? I suppose it will be the last episode, right? Guys, can I know why I ended up in Antarctica? Weren't we supposed to be in an asylum? I don't know, Barack. That elevator ride was quite long. At least we didn't end up in China. Well, for now, the game isn't that scary, but I hope it becomes interesting at some point. Bro, this symbol reminds me of something I can't remember exactly what, but it must have been pretty secret. Hmm, it seemed way too clean to me. What do you mean by that? Or about the blood and stuff in front of me, I suppose. Obama, come on, man. You are disgusting. What are you saying? I haven't done anything at all. In fact, I've been wandering around this whole time, and if you're talking about the organs, Joe, you can definitely go fuck yourself. I wonder what happened down there. We've dealt with a lot of horrible things since we've been in this asylum, but this seems like someone was blown up alive. Do you think it's the work of the demon from last time? The priest or that fat pig who's been chasing us since the beginning? Potentially the demon. The priest wouldn't have been able to do that. And the big monster isn't capable of it either. Actually, it gives the impression that someone literally teleported, so yeah. That sounds pretty logical to me. Hmm, what the hell was that noise? At this point, it's impossible to know where we are seriously. Are we in the desert or what is happening? Oh, I don't like what I'm hearing right now. At least we know you're not safe here. You think so, Joe? You really think so? 
Of course, look, there's blood everywhere and a strange sound. What more do you want? Joe, Obama's trolling you if you haven't noticed anything. Seriously, why is it so dark every time? Oh no, motherfucker, he found me. I need to get out of here. Obama, you sick bastard, you just blinded me. Is he behind me or not? I don't understand this situation anymore. Come on, come on, come on. Oh no. For fuck's sake, did we fuck his mother to make him follow us so much or what? What the fuck just happened? I don't know, man. I just want to finish this game now. It was quite epic and satisfying, I must admit. That maniac was constantly chasing me. Joe, you played the most in this game, and just one encounter with that guy was enough to drive me crazy. So honestly, respect, man. Who the fuck is this guy? Probably a Nazi, Joe. Are you saying that because he has a German accent, or have you become even more racist than ever before? Obama, what kind of mindset could be behind an organization that tortures and abuses people in an asylum in such a horrifying way? Do you really think the person behind all of this was an Indian or what? Oh, seriously, not again. Give me a break. What the hell are you waiting for? Dude, seriously, I didn't understand what I'm supposed to do. Where am I supposed to go? Barack, you're fighting against a ghost that can pass through doors. Do you really think what you just did is helpful? Donald, shut the fuck up. All I do is trying to survive. I hope he won't be able to follow me through the vents. Where did the ghost go? Did it get lost along the way? If that's really the case, then that's a relief, I suppose. Anyway, we should probably head to the center to kill that thing. Let's hope he doesn't hear my footsteps. Dude, this place is as big as the asylum. How did they manage to build such a massive complex, seriously? Embezzlement of funds and the involvement of multiple private companies for the workforce, I suppose. What the hell is happening? Was he just behind me or is he going to be in front of me? I'm not sure about it, Barack, but you should hurry in any case. We're dealing with a damn demon this time. Holy shit, this place looks like a CIA office. By the way, did you know that this game was inspired by real events involving the... Joe, if you don't want to end up like Kennedy, I advise you not to finish your sentence. I'm telling you this for your own good, dude. I feel sorry for the guy who was in the hamster ball. The hamster ball? Seriously, Joe? Well, to me, it looked like a hamster ball. You must have some dark shit custom hamster ball for BDSM then, because I have never seen a hamster ball like that. I would really like to have a priest with me right now. This son of a bitch needs to be exercised. Being chased by that fat pig was bad enough, but now I have the invisible motherfucker behind me. Obama, you're even more annoying than Joe. Can't you stop complaining for a few minutes? Seriously, that's why we don't let you play anymore. What the hell are you talking about again? Out of all the people I know, you're the one who complains the most. Goodness gracious, that's a lot of stairs. Indeed, Joe and I wonder who can struggle so much to climb them. Well, I imagine it's you, since you're fat. What the fuck? You take that back right now, you little bitch. But I didn't do anything. I was just expressing my point of view on the matter. Bro, shit, I can feel it right behind me. This thing is literally behind me. Holy shit. Goddamn, Barack, I saw that one. Good job. Was this thing faster than you, or was it trailing behind you from the beginning? Faster than me, I don't think so, but it was definitely scripted.
Well, the probability of not getting an electric shock with all those cables, that guy is really lucky. Lucky? Joe, you sick psychopath. This guy ends up in an asylum with lunatics and loses his fingers, probably with some broken ribs, and you think he's lucky? Am I dreaming or did that thing just play football with my body? Come on, Barack, you can make it. Die in your bubble, motherfucker. Bro, he is generating red wine. What the hell are you doing? What do you mean by what the hell are you doing? I'm literally getting pinned here. The guy values his camera more than his own life. Bro, think he is Michael Jordan. Ouch, that one must hurt. Okay, short recap, he played football with my body and now he is inside me? Am I his bitch here or what the fuck? Ah, finally a shortcut to freedom. Lord Voldemort is doing ASMR to us or what is happening? What the hell are they doing here? Motherfucker, this Nazi used us. I was sure of it. Yeah, fuck it, dude. I'm so sick of getting cuck at video games. You have become the host. All right, well, looks like I have become Batman now. <laughs>